After back to school shopping, college students are tasked with storing everything that they bought. Yeah, but dorm rooms can be known to be small and the limited space often has to be shared with roommates. Right. Well, here's ABC's Melissa Don with tips on how to make the most of the tiny living space. College bound with belongings in tow. Moving into a college dorm is exciting, but it can also be challenging to squeeze so much into a small space. When you're living in a dorm room, you really have to be creative of how you fill your space and what you bring with you to school. Planning ahead can prevent headaches on move in day. Chances are if you're not using an item at home, you're probably not going to use it at school. So just be really intentional about what you're bringing with you. Instead of packing extra towels and bedding, one set that is washed regularly will take up less space and connect with roommates to decide who's bringing what to avoid doubling up on things like a coffee maker or hair dryer. And then once you get to school, your closet is going to be your number one storage space. So you're going to want to maximize that the best that you can. Hanging longer clothing on one end of the closet and shorter pieces on the other leaves room for a freestanding storage unit underneath the shorter items. And more clothing will fit when using slim hangers instead of bulky ones. Outside the closet, create more space by using bed risers to lift up the bed. It's going to provide you with a few extra inches of storage space underneath your bed. And what you can do is get rolling bins that you could throw in under and you can use it to store everything from books to clothing to shoes and anything else you may have. Melissa Don, ABC News, Los Angeles.